authors, soon to be authors. This is Stephanie at Perucci Publishing, your book marketing expert. I'm here today to tell you about lead generators for your book. And before I dive into the 13 amazing lead generators that authors of mine have successfully used to become lead generators for their book, which can be great in advertising, great for conversions, great for uh, helping you build your email list, I want you to do me a favor, like and subscribe to this video and make sure that you turn on the notifications so that anytime I go live or feel inspired to give you some great content about marketing your books, you will get a notification. Y'all, I have today 13 tips for lead generators for your book. A lead generator is basically something that's going to excite someone to buy your book, something that's gonna compel them to surrender their email address. The reason this is important is because the more email addresses that you have to market to, the more people you have to market your services or even future books. So let's talk about number one, a great lead generator, a great free giveaway for your book is the buy one, get one offer. So just today, I spoke with someone who's in the cannabis space and he said, you know, what kind of lead generator would I possibly have? My book is selling my consulting services, my high ticket $100,000 consulting package. And I illustrated to him that a buy one, get one is the best offer for his book. If everyone who buys the book gets a free copy of the book, the cool thing about his community is that in the cannabis space, these people talk to each other. They spend a lot of time um, engaging with one another, inspiring one another. There's intimacy in that community among growers and marketers and people in advanced technologies. The cannabis community, from my experience, having published High Curious by Lauren Mundell, is an intimate community. So my recommendation is that for everyone who buys a book, he gives them another copy and they're gonna give it to someone else in his target market. His revenue is not gonna get generated from book sales. This guy is selling $100,000 consulting packages. And cannabis is such a hard place to market in that he's gonna do very well. So the next offer, this is kind of the fundamental lead generator for books, is the free plus shipping offer. You say, my book is free, all you pay is shipping. This is the quintessential offer that probably most people by far that I know of give away for their book. To get people to buy the book, they say the book is free, you just pay shipping. People love free stuff. They love the free extra book they're going to get. And they also love to think they're getting the book for free, especially if it's a beautiful hardcover copy that they're proud to put on their shelf. So the free plus shipping offer is very common. I've built just, just this year, I've built a half dozen or so free plus shipping offers for my authors. The next offer that you can give away the next lead generator to get people to buy your book or at least surrender their email address on your website is to give away a supplement or some other product. The cool thing is if you give the product away but you charge enough in shipping to cover the costs, it's free list building. So one of my authors is giving away something called Immunowise Supplement. He's giving the bottle, but he's charging shipping that's gonna, gonna cover the cost of the bottle. So he's not losing any money, but he's gaining lots of people who want free stuff. The fourth amazing uh, lead generator for your book is for people who are dying to read your book and it's not launched yet, you can in your pre-order or pre-launch phase give away a free chapter, either audio or ebook. In fact, you can even let your readers know, hey, I'm not going to do an audio book, but I recorded the best chapter for free. You're going to get it on my website. Send me your email address. I'll throw you the download. And now you're building your email list. You've given away something that costs you zero dollars. And it's something you can't get anywhere else in the world except through your website. The next uh, free, uh, the next lead generation offer that people use very commonly 
to get more subscribers and readers to their books is the masterclass. Generally, you want this to be hyper niched. You don't want it to be an all encompassing masterclass, such as the five greatest tips for marketing. What you want to instead look at doing with your masterclass, two things. Number one, keep it to 20 minutes. People don't want, if, if you can give them 15 to 20 really great tips, your best tips in that 15 minutes, they're gonna want more. But if you're giving away every great tip you've ever had in 15 minutes, they're not gonna buy or read your book. So a masterclass, the next thing you wanna do with your masterclass besides keeping it to 15 or 20 minutes, what I want you to do is focus on either how they can avoid pain or how they can gain pleasure. So the consummate argument is, um, do this and you're gonna lose 10 pounds. I don't recommend doing that, but it works. And the other, so that's how do I get pleasure or how do I avoid pain? Uh, one of my authors just did a masterclass, which was you know, the top three mistakes almost everybody makes in divorce. I'm gonna tell you what, if you're getting a divorce, you wanna to listen to that masterclass. It has a very high conversion rate. She was a bestseller overnight for her book because she wisely marketed that masterclass. She said, hey, if you go buy my book, I'm gonna give you this free masterclass, top three mistakes people make in divorce and how you can avoid them. So remember how people want to avoid pain and receive pleasure. And that's what you need to think about when you're building your masterclass. The sixth thing that you can give away, and I've seen this work with great effect for people in the mental health and self-development space, is a poster. A poster that they can hang on their wall, a poster that they can put up in their bathroom with affirmations. Maybe it's gonna be a, a vision board. It could be a manifestation vision board. It could be yoga posture vision board, whatever. But some something that they can hang up in their office, on their mirror, on the refrigerator. Not only are they being challenged with the principles from your book and your teachings, if it's, let's say, self-development or even business or communication, but the other thing is, that poster is an advertisement of your book and your business for everyone else who sees it. The next, the seventh lead generator that I've seen people do with great effect is a wristband, like a bracelet that you wear, and that's going to have maybe a mantra, maybe it's gonna have a phrase from the book, so that every time they look at that wristband, they're gonna remember. One of my authors has a wristband that he's designed for veterans with PTSD that says strong, reminding them that they're strong and that it's not easy to re-assimilate into civilian life after you have been programmed as a soldier. It's a brilliant giveaway. They, 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 they're wildly popular among so many of the veteran communities. Um, another giveaway in that community, coincidentally, is a fidget spinner or a, um, a poker chip. So that's, that's, that's number seven and a half, that's a bonus. The eighth lead generator is a discovery or insights call. Don't waste your time doing this unless you stand to make a lot of money. You're great at sales and you have a high conversion rate because or else you will spend 90% of your life giving people free advice. Don't do discovery or insight calls unless you know how to manage them, unless you have boundaries, unless you know how to close a deal. If you need more training on discovery and insight calls, everyone tells you to do them. And I'm going to tell you what, I know more people who've wasted hours, hours of every single day for years doing insights and discovery calls that never uh, increase revenue in their business, that only waste their time and make them hate their life and their job. So if you're gonna do the Discovery Your Insights call, I'm here to warn you, it might sound like you're giving a lot away and you wanna get on the phone with people. Y'all, don't get on the phone with people unless you know how to close them. The ninth amazing lead generator that I've seen people do is a template or a guide. So I have a man um, who, who has a, a great template of everything you need to know to file your taxes as an entrepreneur. I have another guy that I know who's got a guide to everything you need to, uh, a checklist uh, or a guide of everything that you need to know um, to run a, a family entertainment business, okay? Um, 
Another one is how to increase retention in his industry. So you can use these templates, these guides, or these checklists to give someone something that's very high value, but doesn't close the door on them needing you for higher level, higher ticket services in the future. And they're going to want to read your book and learn more about how you develop that template, guide, or checklist. So the next lead generator, number 10, is the number one secret to blank. You'll see me do it a lot in my YouTube videos, um, but you'll see it a lot in, in, in every YouTube video. And it might sound like clickbait, but when you can, what it does for the creator, the content creator, is it allows them to give people a, 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 a bite-sized kind of taste of their offer without overwhelming them with content. So if you've got a busy target audience or niche and you're only giving them one bite-sized morsel, um, the number one secret or the number one thing to avoid, what this does for them is it's going to allow people to get a taste of you before they're ready to buy or invest 20 minutes of their life into a video. I struggle, I've, I've actually been researching the, or, or keeping track of this myself. I struggle with any video that's more than 20 minutes long, anything, even if it's a subject that I'm wildly crazy interested in. The 11th lead generator, G, lead generator that I recommend that works really, really well for book lead generation is to give someone free access to a membership site or free access to a private community. You can even give them free access to your app or your education program or your members area or something like that. The caveat is if you're an intelligent person, you're gonna make sure that after a month, that membership expires and if you're giving great content which you should be doing they're gonna have to pay to get more of it the other uh the other number 12 for the awesome um, lead generators for your book is if you're giving them a trial offer of something so this is kind of like giving them free access where you're you're getting them uh, acclimated to the community but oftentimes with 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 trial offers what people miss out on is the power of a supportive, engaging community. So that's the reason that I like that my, my authors market free uh, app access because people get connected to the community within the app. The, the community creates content in the app and it creates intimacy and it, it's, it's a sticky product. Um, the, 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 I think the 13th, yeah, the, the 13th lead generator that, uh, people are using to absolutely great, great, uh, end with book, book publishing is when you're giving away unseen bonus footage. So if you've recorded an audiobook, give them all the secret cut, uh, editing room floor files that didn't make it to the audiobook or it's the X-rated, so to speak, content that you couldn't put in the book because maybe it was too salacious or too, um, too sexy or, or just a bit too controversial. People love a controversy. They love the, the, the under the kimono type stuff. So a great lead generator for your offer is going to be, this was co too controversial or too sexy or too salacious to publish, but I'm gonna give it to you as a private bonus piece of content. When you generate leads, you sell more books, and when you add to your email list, you've got more people to market your second, third, fourth, fifth books too. So build your email list. Here's a list of great lead generators. I've been doing this for 12 years, and I'll probably think of more of these, but I gotta keep my videos under 20 minutes, or I'm a hypocrite because I just told you to keep yours under 20 minutes. So 13 lead generators, I think they all kick ass. I tried to give you obviously a bunch of examples of real authors using these lead, lead generators in their business because we're kind of getting to the point where people are getting sick of the free plus shipping offer. And, and it's, it's important that we as book marketers get creative with our lead generating tools. Remember, you can drive all the traffic in the world to your book, 
But if you don't have a sexy lead generator, not a lot of those people are going to opt in, buy your book, surrender their emails, et cetera, et cetera. And uh, if you know anything about how important it is to build a subscriber list or email list with your book, then you understand the value of that. If not, watch more of my YouTube videos. And I am grateful for y'all being here. Like, subscribe, follow, share, and get notified next time I'm live or posting content about book marketing. Because hey, as Frank McKinney said, your book is a business with four corners. And I think he's brilliant for saying that. It's true. My entire philosophy with my publishing is that your book is a business with four quarters. So get it done right, be smart, be strategic, and use one of these awesome 13 lead generators. Thank you.